Hey everybody, Sarah Grillo here, coming at you with some advice for those of you that want to start your own fund. Oh, okay, so look, I'm sorry about this, but I'm actually nine months pregnant, could have the baby at any moment, and so I'm so stuffed that my lungs are like about this big, and so I'm gonna really be gasping a lot as I talk, I might have to stop. <sighs> Anyways, question is, should I start my own incubator fund with $50,000. This is from Michael Shabilsky. Michael, thank you for your question. Um, my personal track record is pretty good, but I realize it really only counts when there's some kind of legal entity behind the performance. Yes. Okay. So two things about starting your own hedge fund with your own personal capital. Uh, the first thing is that you should be very mindful of the way that you're tracking performance. Is it GIPS compliant? Does it go by some kind of methodology, net of fees, gross of fees? Um, you know, what, what is the actual methodology that you're using? And this is really important because you've just got to get standardized. If it's, there's any question at all to how you're coming up with the results that you're stating, then nobody's going to believe you is going to completely detract from your credibility. That's the first thing. The second thing is, oh my goodness. Um, sorry about that. See, when I talk a lot, it like gets really bad too. Um, so the second thing is the actual legal entity. Well, yes. Um, you know, establishing some kind of an LLC or LLP for the thing, uh, you know, I mean, it won't cost you a million dollars. And I mean, that I don't know if, you so much have if you are serious about bringing outside investors in then yes you have to have a legal structure but i think if you're just using this as a way to demonstrate your performance then you could maybe just use your own investment account but like i said you know it has to be legit like you can't when you talk about your performance you can't cherry pick on your stock picks you know you have to present your total performance holistically and have integrity about it so um the other thing is like if you just do this with fifty thousand dollars you have to understand that it's not going to scale that well you know uh the trades that you can make with fifty thousand dollars um are, are not going to be the trades that a large fund is going to want to make you know um so i would think about that too um you know, maybe you just want to model out a strategy and maybe the performance itself won't necessarily be something that you are necessarily going to hold out. It could be more just for demonstrative purposes because, I mean, everybody knows that $50,000 is not, you know, going to be anywhere. The kinds of trades you make on a $50,000 portfolio are nowhere near the one you would make on a 500000 or even like $5 million portfolio. So... Thanks for watching. I hope you didn't mind the um, breathlessness. Sorry, everybody. And uh, please thumbs up this video if you like it. Bye.